Thank you for tuning in to the Keeping It Real with KC podcast. A no judgment zone podcast that covers lifestyle, entertainment, news, and sports. Even though KC doesn't watch sports, but these are minor details. (laughs) By the way, he reads tarot cards too. Yes, I really mean it. He reads tarot cards, too. And now, the host you've tuned in for, K.C. Phoenix. Welcome back to the Keeping It Real with K.C. podcast. I, of course, am your host, K.C. Phoenix. And it is time for your lucky numbers for Saturday. I was about to say Friday for some reason. I'm I'm a day behind. (laughs) For Saturday. January the 14th, before I go any further, KIRWKC.com, main podcasting platform. This podcast is carried on Apple, Spotify, Google, iHeartRadio, Pandora, Overcast, Bullhorn, Amazon Music, Audible, and several other podcasting platforms. Please feel free to listen to this podcast on whatever platform is most convenient for you. KIRWKC on all the social media platforms. For those who are new to this, I have a large vase. It has red balls that have numbers on them. They're mixed in with crystals. I pull six numbers out of the vase. And then those are your lucky numbers. And throughout the process, I'll go over what's resonating, which might be some numbers that I didn't pull and all that other jazzy stuff. As I always say, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. This is for entertainment purposes only. However, if you happen to win anything, Using the lucky numbers, please give the show a shout out or bless the cash app. K-I-R-W-K-C. Here we go. The first number is 23. The second number is 77. Hmm, interesting. The third number is 69. The fourth number is 50. The fifth number is 49. And the sixth number is two. So let's read back over these and then we'll discuss. Excuse me. The first number is 23. The second number is 77. The third number is 69. The fourth number is 50. The fifth number is 49. And the sixth number is two. All right. 77, obviously, that's high. 7 is resonating with me more than 14. For those who don't know who are new to this, I know some people are like, okay, where did you get 14 from? 7 plus 7. Um, if 14 is resonating with you, you may want to do that. You could. Or you could do number 5 as well. Because don't forget, 7 plus 7 is 14. 1 plus 4 is 5. It, where you're reducing the number. So if... 5, 7, or 14 is resonating with you, you could play any or all of those numbers. For the number 69, 
honestly, six and nine are not resonating with me. So I would do the six plus nine and do that, which is 15. Um, if six or nine is resonating with you, you can consider playing it. Um, as for 15, obviously, if you do one plus five, it's going to equal, take you back to six. So that's kind of a no-go on that. But yeah, if six or nine is resonating with you, fine. But honestly, 15 is resonating with me more for this, for those two. Um, looking at the other numbers... Definitely, I will say, like I mentioned before with the 77, a number that is resonating with me is the number five. Even though I didn't pull it, I'm seeing, for some reason, I'm just picking up five is what I'm picking up. Because we actually have five three times in this. If you, the first number is 23, two plus three is five. And then 77, 7 plus 7 is 14, 1 plus 4 is 5. And then the number 50, 5 plus 0 is 5. So we have 5 three times in this. So 5 is definitely resonating a lot. Uh, some of you may want to consider playing that if it's resonating with you. I'm trying to see if there's anything else. Honestly, that is... Well, I will say this because it, it, it was on my mind when I first pulled the first number. For some reason, I flipped thir 23 around, which was the first number, and something was saying 32. So, yeah, if the number 32 is resonating with anyone, maybe you want to play the number 32. Just throwing that out there. All right. So those are your lucky numbers for Saturday, January the 4th. Oh, I was about to say the 14th. Today's the 15th. My g Mercury has started retrograding. This is why I'm so tongue tied right now. <laughs> I'm blaming it on Mercury. For those who don't know, Mercury started retrograding. It's, it will retrograde until February the 3rd. And it will probably post retrograde will probably be seven to 10 days after that. So maybe February the 13th, give or take. So just keep that in mind. Mercury is retrograding. For those who are not familiar with Mercury retrograde, communication slows down. Um, communication gets mixed up. Communication also gets lost as well. So yeah, <laughs> just keep all that stuff in mind. Along with other things with Mercury retrograde, you should look it up sometime. KIRWKC.com, main podcasting platform. This podcast is carried on Apple, Spotify, Google, iHeartRadio, Pandora, Overcast, Bullhorn, Amazon Music, Audible, and several other podcasting platforms. Please feel free to listen to this podcast on whatever platform is most convenient for you. KIRWKC on all the social media platforms. Until next time, be blessed.